Now I wish my roommate had just said no. I told him that. He just took me to the store. I wish he had said no. It never crossed my mind that I couldn't have angels. See, it, see I don't know. But once I turned him over to the, the, the animal control officer, then they be, it, she becomes their property and... Or not necessarily their property, but they, they've held on to her for longer because of my, our friend, you know, knows them and whatnot, but... And she found a foster home and... It's not that Angel wouldn't be happy, but these people might not even be able to keep her, might not want to keep her, you know, but they only care what's best for the dog, whereas I wanted my mom to not lose her dog, see, but they can find a much better home than, than it just never crossed my mind. I thought, well, it's my mom's dog, and I was with the dog for over a year, and Angel and Oma love each other, and that was her home, you know. There's nothing that I can do. I'm quote unquote, quote, off the hook, unquote, you know. Um, Because it wasn't that I really, really wanted Angel. I wanted my mom to not lose her, you know. Although I wouldn't have minded having her, I'm sure I would have grown to love her, my not because in the summer I was, with my shoulder from I was thinking about taking Angel in over, I didn't know what was going to happen to my mom, you know, I didn't know how much power Marion had. They'll find her a good home. Maybe these people will decide to keep her. They had said that they didn't want another dog. You know, they were just going to foster her, keep her. I mean, I want my mom to have her, but... <laughs>